Here we go. This is uh, the Colbert Raptor. And I spelled Colbert, B-E-A-R, because Colbert is afraid of bears. He loves the American Eagle, so I made a Colbert Raptor. And then he always is saying, no! So I had the eagle getting him by the ear, that ear that's funny of his. <laughs> and there you have it. That's it. That's all there is to it. Good. What, what other ideas have you got? And this is, what, this is a quilt. Uh, right. This is it's quilt. a quilt. It's got a front, back, and a middle. Okay. It's a sandwich. Okay, so you can might talk one, a little about quilting, Judy. Okay. Judy, how do you pronounce your last name? Pascalis. Pascalis? Yeah. And she's married well, one to... One day, uh, oh, Manos and I Manos saw this Pascalis. guy, this biker-looking guy, with a tiny little foo-foo dog, and we said, oh my God, that's so funny. And then I looked it up, and lo and behold, there is a theory of incongruity, theory of humor that's incongruity. So I made, anyway, I made this quilt. I was going to make the quilt, and then I named it that, and in looking it up, there it was. In 1725, Francis Hutchison expressed in Thoughts on Laughter what became a key concept in the perception of incongruity in humor. <laughs> Well, I'll go a little deeper into that. Well, you you mean how it just doesn't make sense? Well, it's just funny to see this biker, great big old biker guy with this little foo foo dog. Yes, it is. Incongruity. Yes. And then this one, actually, um, that's really interesting to me because people in, I have a blog, and so when I put this on last year in July, and people in 67 to 70 countries have now viewed this this quilt and um, it's really interesting to me that this little grandma in Toledo, Ohio can make something that people all over the world have looked at. So grandma, tell me about this, uh, tell me about this quilt, a little bit well, about it. it was, you know, it just, uh, of, of course Facebook did not make the revolution, but they, um, it was the way that the people communicated over social media. Mm -hmm. So. I'm, you know, in keeping with the Facebook thing, I put them that we would remove them as friends, because that's what you do on Facebook if you don't want somebody oh, as a good. friend. Oh, good. Gaddafi. Yeah. Did you do this before Gaddafi was removed? No. <laughs> Very no, funny. but uh, so, no, they were all, I think they were all removed. No, you're right. Gaddafi, I think, was still on there. Okay. But Assad, of course, is still there uh -huh. murdering everybody. Uh -huh. And then I put on the little gal in Saudi Arabia saying, give us the car keys. And I think they have been able to get car keys drive now. Oh, good one. And then I saw on CNN, you know, somebody holding up a sign, game over for Mubarak. So I, I, you know, so we're on Egypt right now, and they're having some problems yes, over there in Egypt and sure in, in Libya. Sure and uh, I wonder how, as this comes down to this, how the Facebook revolution how is that going to play out in this? I, well, I haven't heard. You know, democracy is messy. Mm hmm Very messy. Still at times. Still is, but at least it's not bloody here. That's true. Not yet. No. <laughs> we hope it doesn't get bloody. That's right. So what, is, what have we got here? Oh, that's just, Manos loves this one. I don't know. I was in Kansas and sitting in a bank, and I saw this Toledo scale. And anyway, they had a little hook on the side over here, and probably for coats, but you know, I'm so weight conscious, or have been in my life, not mm -hmm. particularly now, that I would have to take off all my clothes, even though it was in the <laughs> To get up on me too. <laughs> Don't want any I extra you know, ounces, you know. So, that's you nude, huh? Yeah, well. Uh, or, well, whoever it is. <laughs> yeah. At the Hutchinson National Bank. In, in Hutchison, Kansas. Oh, Hutchison, that's Kansas. That's where I was born. Oh, well, welcome home. I like it, I like that the outside here. So what what else have we got here? Oh gosh. What, what, do, you, what do you like? Well, what do I like? I love this one. This one, I love this um, tumblebee. Okay, which one? The tumbleweeds. Oh. So tell me about this. Well, it's just, you know, the song from the Sons of the Pioneers and uh, drifting along with the tumbleweeds. Tumble but I, this is actually the way Kansas looks. The tum tumbleweeds go over into the corner. Of, they go down the fence roll, and then they stop in the corner. It's all bad. So I like that so one. So let me see the tumbleweeds here. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice tumbleweeds. 
This one I made in 2005 when the Iraqis were voting. I have. Yeah, I love it. This one here? This one. I saw on CNN, this was a shot between, you know how they give you a bumper shot, they call it. Mm -hmm. And uh, they had her, she was smiling real big, a woman, and had her fingers up. She voted, and she was very happy. Oh, good. Let's see. Over here is Life's Carl Life Rove. statements. Carl Rove trying to keep the lid on the tea party. It hasn't done a very good job. Oh, there's Carl. At the time, Sarah Palin was very... You know, with it. Okay. But she's kind of out of it now. Carol, who's Ted? Ted? Oh, Ted. T's ready. It says. Oh, T's ready. Read, oh, and it's Sarah Palin. Where the A came was a oh, star, yeah. so it oh, makes yeah. it look like Ted, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. So that's just about it, Chuck. <laughs> okay. Good. Thank you. Well, thank you.